Did you just hear what's happening in the camera world? Because what I've uncovered today might be one of the biggest full-frame mirrorless leaks of Toyota 5. And no, this is not a drill. The Sony A7V, the long-awaited successor to the wildly successful A7 IV is finally surfacing, and the early specs, release timeline, and pricing leaks are already turning the entire photography and filmmaking community upside down. Whether you're a professional photographer, a content creator, a hybrid shooter, or someone who's been holding off on upgrading for just the right moment, this could be that game-changing moment. And I'll be honest what I'm about to tell. You might completely change the way you look at mid-range full-frame cameras forever. Let's get one thing straight Sony isn't just tweaking the A7IV here. The A7V is shaping up to be a major generational leap that combines high-resolution stills, pro-grade video performance, bleeding-edge autofocus powered by AI, and an aggressive price point that undercuts competitors like Canon, Nikon, Panasonic, and even Sony's own FX line. According to multiple reliable industry sources, the Sony A7V will feature a 44-megapixel full-frame CMOS sensor, non-stack, but paired with a dramatically upgraded processor that allows for a massive 20 frames per second continuous burst rate. That's right 20 FPS, which is double the 10 FPS offered by the A7 IV, and creeping into flagship-level territory once reserved for cameras like the A9 series. But this isn't just about speed. Sony appears to be going all-in on next generation. AI-enhanced autofocus, with leaks pointing to an integrated AI processing unit a dedicated chip designed specifically to improve subject recognition, tracking, and predictive focus. We're not just talking about tracking humans and animals anymore. The A7V reportedly recognizes vehicles, birds, insects, and even fast-moving objects in highly complex environments. Imagine pointing your camera at a dragon flea in flight or a Formula One car midrace, and the camera doesn't just lock focus it predicts where it's going next. This is no longer about autofocus performance. It's about autofocus intelligence. If you thought the photo specs were insane, Wait until you hear what the Sony A7V is offering for filmmakers and hybrid content creators. Multiple reports now confirm that this camera will support full frame. For K video at 120 frames per second with no crop. Yes, you heard that right, no crop. That means you'll get buttery smooth, cinematic slow motion footage at full sensor width. Preserving every bit of dynamic range, depth of field, and field. A view your lens offers. Combine that with 10-bit 4 to 2 to internal recording. S Cinetone, S Log 3, and possibly even HLG support. And you're getting video specs that rival cinema cameras twice the price. Let's break that down for, for MP for detailed stills, to OFPS for high speed, action, for K1 to OP for ultra smooth slow motion, and AI driven autofocus that practically reads your mind. If you're a wildlife photographer, a wedding filmmaker, a YouTuber, or even a solo shooter looking to simplify your rig while still delivering cinematic results, this is the kind of hybrid camera that might finally tick every box. And speaking of boxes, let's talk build. The A7V is rumored to borrow heavily from Sony's higher-end Alpha line. With a robust magnesium alloy chassis, weather sealing comparable to the A1, and potentially even the same 9 point for million dot electronic viewfinder. Used in Sony's flagship mirrorless, that alone makes this feel like a premium piece of kit far beyond its expected price point. But that's not all early reports suggest Sony has focused heavily on thermal management, redesigning the internal heatsink layout to minimize overheating, during long for k video sessions or extended burst shooting, for content creators shooting in hot environments or recording extended interviews or YouTube videos. That means one less thing to worry about. Let's talk ports and ergonomics. The Sony A7V is expected to feature dual card slots, a full-size HDMI port, a USB-C 3.2 Gen to connector, and potentially support for SSD external recording through USB. Add in a fully articulating touchscreen, improved tactile buttons, and a slightly deeper grip hand, you've got a camera designed not just for performance, but for comfort and practicality during long shooting days. Now here's where it gets wild. According to insiders, the Sony A7V will launch with a target price between $2,700 and $3,000 USD, that's just $200 to $500 more than the A7 IV's launch price of $2. For $199 yet you're getting a sensor resolution bump, double the burst speed, AI autofocus for K1 to OP video with no crop, a cinema grade viewfinder, and a redesigned thermal system. Put simply, if these leaks are true, this camera is going to be the best price to performance full frame camera in the industry. No exaggeration. Let me put this in perspective for you. Cameras like the Canon R6 Mark to max out at 24MP, 
Panasonic's S5 to offers good video but lacks Sony's autofocus power. Nikon Z63 is impressive but doesn't offer for K1 to OP. And while Sony's FX3 and A1 deliver incredible performance, they also carry massive price tags. The A7V is aiming to deliver 90% of flagship features at a fraction of the price, and that should terrify the competition. But before you get too excited, let's talk timeline. The Sony A7V has reportedly been registered in official databases as of May 2025, signaling that it's already cleared key regulatory milestones. Leaks suggest a Q3 or Q for 2025 announcement, potentially in late September or October. However, widespread availability may slip into early 2026. Depending on production schedules and global supply chain logistics, if you've been thinking about upgrading your current gear, this gives you just enough time to start preparing whether that means saving up or planning your pre-order strategy. And if you're planning to sell your current gear to make room for the A7V, now might be the right time. Once this camera officially drops, prices for models like the A7IV, Canon R6 II, and even older cinema-style cameras could see significant depreciation. We're looking at a scenario where the used gear market could shift dramatically overnight, with older cameras suddenly losing 30 to 40% of their value as everyone rushes toward this new benchmark. That's the disruptive potential of the Sony A7V. It doesn't just threaten to outperform its competition, it threatens to redefine what a $3,000 hybrid camera can do. That's why so many professionals and creators are already calling this the full-frame camera to beat in 2025. And here's another thing to keep your eyes on Sony isn't stopping here. Reports suggest that this camera is just the beginning of a wave of new alpha releases, including a possible Sony A9 III, an FX30 Mark II, and even the A1 successor all in development for 2026, but for the average creator who wants the most value-packed, future-proof hybrid body. The A7V might be the smartest camera investment of the year. So, should you wait? Should you buy? Should you sell your current gear now or hold off? Well, if you're serious about capturing the best images, delivering stunning for K-slow motion, locking focus on birds, bugs, or bikes with near-psychic accuracy, and doing it all in a weather-sealed, pro-grade bada then yes, the A7V might be everything you've been waiting for. But remember supply might be tight and initial pre-orders will likely sell out fast. Stay tuned. Because I'll be following every development, every official teaser, and every hands-on leak the moment it breaks. In fact, in my next video, I'll be covering the top 10 most anticipated camera releases of 2025 including what Canon, Nikon, Fujifilm, and even Blackmagic are cooking up. So if you're serious about staying ahead of the curve and avoiding expensive mistakes hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications.